Hi friends, let's continue plus two marks NCRT syllabus University Geometry. Remember that? Tan inverse x minus tan inverse y is equal to tan inverse x minus y by 1 plus x y. In this case, x y is greater than negative 1. Product of x and y, it is greater than negative 1. How to prove it? It's a simple case. Put tan alpha equals x and tan beta equals y. Left hand side is equal to tan inverse x minus tan inverse y. What is tan inverse x? If tan alpha is equal to x, tan inverse x will be alpha minus what is tan inverse y? We have taken tan beta is equal to y therefore tan inverse y must be beta so we got left hand side equal to alpha minus beta now take the right hand side right hand side is tan inverse x minus y by 1 plus x y that is equal to tan inverse x is tan alpha tan alpha minus tan y is tan beta by 1 plus tan alpha tan beta and it's equal to tan inverse of in the 11th standard you have studied tan alpha minus beta is equal to tan alpha minus tan beta divided by 1 plus tan alpha tan beta this is this fraction is equal to tan alpha minus beta tan inverse see tan inverse tan theta is equal to theta therefore this much will be equal to alpha minus beta we have got left hand side alpha minus beta right hand side also alpha minus beta now LHS equals R H S. Therefore, the result is true. Therefore, tan inverse x minus tan inverse y is equal to tan inverse x minus y by 1 plus x y. Yes. A simple research. Then another one.
Sure, lad. One. Sign in ways. 2x into square root of 1 minus x square is equal to 2 sin inverse x where the value of x lies between negative 1 by root 2 and positive 1 by root 2 including those two figures and 2 sin inverse 2x into square root of 1 minus x square is equal to 2 cos inverse x when 1 by root 2 less than x less than less than or equal to x less than or equal to 1 when the value of x takes the integral 1 by root 2 to 1 then we shall listen 1 So, n inverts 2x into square root of 1 minus x square. Is equal to 2 sin inverts x. Here we shall take Shall take x equals sin theta. Put x equals sin theta. Therefore, LHS equals sin inverse two x into square root of one minus x square that is equal to sin inverse. 2 sin theta into square root of 1 minus sin square theta that is sin inverse 2 sin theta into root of 1 minus sin square theta is square root of cos square theta why root of 1 minus sin square theta is cos square theta See, cos square theta plus sin square theta is equal to 1. Therefore, sin square theta is equal to 1 minus cos square theta is equal to 1 minus sin square theta then taking square roots cos theta is equal to root of 1 minus sin square theta that you have studied in the 10th uh, standard, standard, standard or in the 11th standard so we can write it as sin inverse 2 sin theta into root of cos square theta is cos theta but you have studied sin 2 theta is equal to 2 sin theta cos theta. This result also is already known to you. Sin 2 theta is equal to 2 sin theta cos theta. Therefore, this can be written as sin inverse sin 2 theta. That is 2 theta. Then what is theta? 
we have written x equals sin theta. Therefore, this theta will be sin inverse x. That is 2 sin inverse x. That is equal to right hand side. See, how is it proved? We wrote the results as it is. Then uh, substituted for x. Put x equals sin theta. Now, the left hand side became sin inverse 2 sin theta into square root of 1 minus the x is sin theta. 1 minus sin square theta. Then root of 1 minus sin square theta is root of cos square theta. Root of cos square theta is cos theta. 2 sin theta cos theta is sin 2 theta. Now sin inverse of sin 2 theta is 2 theta. That is 2 into what is this theta? Theta is sin inverse x. So you got the result. Sin inverse 2x into square root of 1 minus x square is equal to 2 sin inverse x. For the interval negative 1 by 2, 2 positive 1 by 2 including those two figures. Now coming to the second one. And don't take it as a silly question. Sometimes such silly questions are asked about the examination too. So, don't take it very silly. You can solve it very well. Still, get some practice. Now, the second one. Sin inverse 2x into square root of 1 minus x square is equal to 2 cos inverse x then x lies between 1 by root 2 and 1. And now put x equals cos theta put x equals cos theta LHS the hand side is sin inverse 2x into square root of 1 minus x square do you know why I took x equals cos theta you have to get this result to cos inverse x so it is better we take x equals cos theta. Now, left hand side equals sin inverse 2x in the square root of 1 minus x square. That's equal to sin inverse 2 x is cos theta. 2 cos theta into root of 1 minus cos square theta. That is sin inverse 2 cos theta root of 1 minus cos square theta is root of sin square theta that is equal to sin inverse 2 cos theta sin theta now you know in the previous example we took this as sin 2 theta that is sin inverse sin 2 theta that is sin inverse of sin 2 theta is 2 theta. Now we shall substitute for theta. Theta is cos inverse x. That is 2 cos inverse x. And we got the result. 
by putting x equals cos theta. Right? And if you are convinced of these results, and if you like my video, please subscribe it. Thank you.